All right, so what I'm gonna do here in Book Creator is show you how you can invite students to join your book in your library and how your students can access that book and collaborate in that book with you. So right now I am in Book Creator as a teacher. I created this book because this is the book that I want to share with you. Um, and you can see right here that it has an invite code. So if I click on that, I'm going to get this invite code. And this code is what you share with your students so that they can join and collaborate in your book. So take note of that uh, join code. Now what I'm gonna do is switch back over into um, my test student. So I'm going to go into Pebbles. And you can see here I'm at the uh, Book Creator login screen. And I'm going to sign in as a student and use the Google um, sign in button. And I'm going to select my account. And right away it asks me to join a library and, and that I need the code. So that's why it's important for you to share that code with your students. So I'm going to type it in. and hit click go. And now the students will have access to your library. So there's two books in this library right now, this activity book and my book that I created with you so that we can share your favorite book. And you can click play here to actually play the book so you can see what content is in there. And I can page through the book by clicking on the next arrow and the uh, back button. And these are videos, so I can go through and I can watch the videos. I can flip through the pages and read the book and actually, you know, get ready to participate. So right now I'm in play mode. So what I wanna do in order to go back into edit mode is go back into my books and hover over the cover of the book and you'll see a pencil icon. And when you click on that pencil icon, now you're in edit mode. So in order for you to add your page to this book, you're gonna click on the next uh, arrow, the next page arrow. And I'm gonna go through it and I'm gonna find the last page. And you can see up top here, there's six pages. And now you can see my arrow turned into a plus sign. So I'm gonna click the plus sign and I'm going to add a new page. And you can see here it says page seven of seven. So right now it took the page, um, the same background from my previous page. So what I wanna do is click on the I button here at the top right, that's the inspector, I, uh, the inspector menu. And you're gonna be able to select different backgrounds, um, different colors, there's a whole there's a whole bunch of different um, styles that you can pick here. Um, so you can go through and check that out. Um, let's just see, I'm gonna go to patterns, we'll do something different. So you can change the background. You can also click on the plus and you can add all different types of objects in here. So you're gonna add um, media, you can import pictures, um, you can take a picture with your uh, webcam, you can draw on it, you can add text boxes in here, and you can also record a video. Uh, if you click on the comics tab, then this is gonna be where you can um, add speech bubbles, you can add stickers, there's different um, text styles that you can add in here as well. Um, so, you know, I can certainly go through and add all that. Uh, if I click the plus sign again, I have a shapes tab and I can insert shapes. If I click on the shape again, I go to the inspector menu. Now I can change the properties of that shape. So I can change the fill. Uh, I can give it a shadow effect if I wanted to. I can give it a border and I can change the thickness of the border if I wanted to. So there's a lot of different things in here that you can do. Um, just remember that the plus sign is gonna allow you to add objects. And when you click on an object, if you click on the eye icon, the inspector, that's gonna allow you to change the properties of the object that, you're, that you selected, all right? 
And basically that's it. So go ahead and have fun, play around with it, see if you um, get a feel for it and let me know. All right, I hope you find this helpful.